Hello everyone, welcome to the Adoran region. I'm your host Adoran himself. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Conquest, already in progress. If you're wondering what the QR code is up on the screen, you can click the subscribe button, check out the previous episodes in the playlist down below while you're down there. Like I said, subscribe, comment, like, do all those things you have to do when supporting a YouTube channel. So, little quick aside before we actually jump into the remainder of the Conquest series, uh, for the remainder of uploads that occur in December, that QR code link up there will be available. It's part of a, a remedial effect, I suppose, of the uh, the Thankmas event that I recently held. Uh, I ran a charity event with a few of my friends from the podcasting side of my uh, content creation universe uh, as part of Thankmas, which you, if you are on YouTube and know Jacksepticeye, you know who that is. Big charity event. Uh, we raised a few hundred dollars and it's going to be going on throughout the remainder of December. So if you would like to, you can donate to that QR code uh, in the top screen. It goes straight to the page. None of the rewards are available, but there are going towards different milestones. If you might have heard through the community tab that there are milestones involving double uploads uh, for two different series that are occurring at the same time. I'm going to be having this Conquest series going and the DLC of the Pokemon Violet game. Two uploads a day, every day, until one of these two series ends. Which one is first? I don't even know, actually. But whichever one ends first, uh, until then, double uploads. And then the second thing is a specific challenge video that I've been dreading, where I go through Pokemon Explores the Sky, but playing as two Shedinja. It's, it's going to be a thing. So... Uh, if you would like to donate, because there are additional milestones, there's a $500 one that uh, is more related to the podcasting side of things, but uh, while not out there, every additional $100 unlocks a new thing bouncing back and forth. So $600 is a new YouTube endeavor um, that uh, is a secret right now, but once we get close, uh, I may announce it. So if you'd like to, you can donate to that section up there. It'll be in the description as well. I'll briefly mention this in future uploads, but you don't have to worry about this taking multiple minutes out of your day um, and again that's for the remainder of the uploads in December because by the end of December uh, the donation link stopped working because you said uh, you know it's a thankless event once December's over Christmas and the holiday season kind of goes with it so that's enough about that again QR codes there it's in the remainder of the conquest episodes let's jump back into this because I'm very excited there is one more location we need to be and that is the fighting gym I'm saying gym hesitantly uh, Pugilist, uh, Pugilist, I don't bother to look up names. That's the smart thing to do. Um, so, the game plan for today, this episode, is going to be twofold. Number one, of course, charge into here, beat this area. The second thing, is somebody recruitable here. I want to go there, figure out who that is, save the day, etc. Et so, um, let's get into that itself. We might as well. Um, I want to make sure the army from Cresselia is the army I end up bringing here which would mean we need a bunch of folks that can beat fighting types. Now, this, remember, is technically considered a Unova game, which means the fairy type does not exist. However, we still got Ralts here who could definitely help out. The bug type is uh, resistant as well, so maybe that can help us as well a little bit. We got a, a bird over here. We'll, we'll figure this out. So, let's actually plan this out. Now, the smart thing to do would be not to send Eevee and Jigglypuff there. However, I refuse in this playthrough to not be involved in the battle. Your commanding warlord must be there. So us two are a lot. Outside of us two, of course, it's kind of a wild card. Uh, we've got a fighting, a fighting, a grass, a fighting, and a fighting. So all of them are weak to flying. Um, I'm not sure what the grass is. Normally that extra guy, so in this case the hand sage, is usually there as a way to stop an opponent, uh, an opposition type. It's like to beat the things that fighting is weak to. Grass isn't going to be flying. Is it going to be rock, I guess? But the game is also programmed so that you're not likely to have a rock type here. I mean, we haven't, I don't think we've encountered somebody with a rock type yet. So I'm not sure what exactly they're looking for here. Nevertheless, um, uh, first things first, let's get the actual army that we want. Uh, so first, I'm going to bring the rocklet over here. And we're going to trade you in for, it doesn't particularly matter who. Because um, I, I don't think any of these guys are going to stick around. But we'll trade you in for that guy. Swap him back and forth. Still love the blimps. Um, let's see, what else do we have? We have the Ralts here. Um, so, we will send you over. We'll pop you over here. And replace you with... Uh, let's just go with the next person on the list. That takes care of that there. Uh, that leaves us with a six-person army here, four of which I'm locking in for super effectiveness. Anybody else that can beat a fighting type? So during this generation, that would be flying, psychic, 
I guess Ghost, technically, because Ghost can't get hit by it. Um, I don't think I don't think any of these guys are gonna work. None of these folks are gonna work. Definitely not the Meowth, I'll tell you that much. Um, none of them, and then none of these folks, as far as I can tell. All right, so next best bet. Um, we're just gonna take the most powerful people. So we need to beat a 144. Anybody that beats a 144, we got to, to bring back the, uh, the Darumaka. One, 176, and then 210. Okay, that feels like what I'm gonna go with. So we're gonna bring you over here, and we'll replace the we'll replace the Tepe. Why not? And then we'll bring the Darumaka back, I suppose, to replace um, the Marie. Darumaka can also help with the super effectiveness on the uh, on the Pan Sage, as uh, I try my best to recruit everybody out there. So you are going to come over here and replace the Marie. All right, and that should leave us with this as our main squad here. Um, Eevee and Jigglypuff, because of course me and Oichi have to stick together through thick and thin here um, as um, the number one and number two in this army. Darumaka and Carnivine just kind of here vibing as big powerhouses, and the other two is super effective move folks. Um, because again, my goal is to recruit everybody I can. Um, and we can certainly get the last four, at the very least. Um, I also want to go here and see who is this person that we could potentially recruit. It's Ekans, okay. And Ekans is very interesting. Adding a poison type is good, I think, defensively, right? Because fighting, attacking poison is resistant. Um, who do we have that can beat a poison type, though? Um, we could bring the Ralts back, but I kind of don't want to do that. Um, let's see, 123, 146. Actually, no, that's not a good idea. That'd be weak. Um, 146, we could move the Mareep over. Let's move Mareep over there. Unfortunately, we don't have super effective moves, so our new strategy, or our strategy for that one would just be to, to win as quickly as possible. I guess in that case, we might as well just bring the most powerful person over here. And I think that's the idea. So we've got six people here that can hopefully Go in, beat up the Ekans real quick, save the day. Yeah, we'll just bring everybody in. Um, Yasutomo, I suppose you will be the leader of this army. Um, so the Ekans is here. Uh, let's real quick, as, uh, or maybe you're running this. Um, whoever's running this. Whoever's got the strategy, figure it out. Um, I also want to check and see if the Pichu is a good link for anybody, a gold link for anybody. Um, so, let's see. I doubt that. It could be you. It's silver for you. Bronze for you. Bronze for you. Some bronze for you as well, and I'm assuming this is going to be a bronze or something. Yeah. Okay. No one's going to be a good link, so uh, I will, I suppose, cut to the end unless something interesting happens. Again, Probably just beat the Pichu and uh, try to recruit the Ekans guys as quickly as possible. So, um, until then, I will be uh, right back. So, cut to that. And a victory in the books. Uh, not too complicated. Um, though I probably won't show it. I accidentally poisoned myself, which, you know how that goes. Uh, but ultimately, a little bit of a boost there, a little bit of gold here, and we can recruit the Ekans. Which is great. Uh, not particularly useful for this immediate fight, but uh, useful going forward. Um, though your your linkage is not particularly good, forty two percent max isn't isn't very great. We'll, we'll work with it. We got we'll figure you out. We'll figure this out. Um, yeah, you do need to be sent elsewhere. And which one of the warring castles would be best for that? Probably using as you're the closest to an issue. Um, but you're gonna train, you're gonna train, you're gonna train. I think it's time, everyone. We're gonna bring this army of nearly a thousand over to fight this army of nearly 900. Um, and we do have some type advantages, so I think we got this. Uh, that's not what I want. Let's go into here. Let's battle. There are lots of fighting type Pokemon in Pugilus. Pugilus. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Anyway, normal type Pokemon like Eevee and Jigglypuff will need to be careful. And we're bringing both of them. 
I just wish we had some flying type or psychic type Pokemon. Uh, did I not? Did I not inform you? I was supposed to inform you. We, we got a flying type and psychic type in the back. Um, yeah, they they just showed up. They're from the other kingdoms. Um, we brought them in. Um, so we, I, I think we're good. We're golden actually, if I have to be honest. See, th this is on me. Okay, lack of communication on my end is causing some uh, miscommunication between the the, the the AI and the the second command here. Uh, but ultimately, we'll just bring the squadron here. Bring everybody in. Let's start the battle. Let's get this going. I need a voice for this guy. Our enemy is also aiming for victory. We must take them on. Fair and square. Yes, or we don't. No, we'll take it on fair and square. Uh, Adoran's army has appeared in Yoshihiro's kingdom of Pugilus. Pugilus. I, I, if I could figure out what the what the, uh, the shtick is, right? So like, violet... You get it because it's light electric. I see that logic. I do not know what the, 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 the pun is behind this name. I can't figure it out. Adurin! I've been waiting for you. Uh, this isn't quite the right voice. I need a... Adurin! I've been waiting for you. There we go. Waiting? What are you... No, no. The so-called warlords of this area are pathetic weaklings. Invading their kingdoms would be no fun at all. I don't know, I've enjoyed myself. Uh, if you've enjoyed this, leave a like. That's clearly what he's saying. Uh, but I've enjoyed low-key, uh, just charging into folks' areas. Being like, hey, how you doing? Boom, I'm the king now. Something does seem to be kicking off in the north. But that's still far away. Now, you're here. I think this could be the most fun I've had in years. Oh boy. I'm assuming since this is a fighting type, the goal is to punch each other out. Uh, our army of 972, 30 turns to beat their army of 873. It's May of year two. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's a fighting area. I'll show you what I'm made of. Protagonist voice here. I will say this, there's a lot of gifts and there's flags. That's a sign of something, right? We must be thankful for this chance. Uh, I think my voice is kind of off from the giant charity stream I did the other day, which reminds me, I won't do this all the time, but the QR code there. Hold all the banners for five turns, or all the enemies hold the banners for five turns. Basically, you need to have the banners and control them for five turns, or punch everybody out. That works as well. Turns left 30, let the battle begin. Presumably. Are you gonna tell me something? Yep, here we go. The banners are at the ring's edge. You know what this means, don't you? It's a gamble, just like everything else in life. There they are. Those hit by attacks when at the ring's edge will fall down below, which is, of course, uh, a problem when you're sitting on the edge and trying to hold it onto the banner. So that's an important thing to note. And of course, we'll have to come all the way out here, I think, to climb back up. Um, but there are little gift packages and other things like that. Um, these folks are very far away. and I do not know if I can recruit all of them, but uh, sure as heck gonna try. So. What is your thing? Um, increase range and make enemies flinch. We won't do that yet. Um, your special ability is detox. That's nice. Uh, your special ability is eagle eye. Okay. Um, I got the range boost. You've got the ultra heal. And your ability is poison paralysis. Okay, so we got a couple detoxers. Which actually, I don't... Uh, maybe they can paralyze us, but they certainly can't. Let's see. Low kick, karate chop, wake up slap, low kick, fun. Okay, I don't think any of those are going to paralyze or anything, but... It could be interesting. I do not know what this bell does, but I'm scared by what the bell could theoretically do. I don't know where the blue is. I mean, we're team blue, but... We're team blue. I wonder. Alright, I'm not going to do that yet. But I will have you fly over here. Um... I don't think you can pop back up. I think you're climbing down, so... Alright, here's what I'm doing. Activate top speed. Just boost this up inst instantaneously. We are zooming. I'm 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 trying to get first first shot. Give me that. Wait there. Claim the banner. Um, you're not gonna move very far. Actually, let's have you move last. All right, we'll have you go. Ooh, you want to go roundabout maybe? No, I don't. I don't like the idea of what the the red one could theoretically do. All right, let's have you pop over here. Wait that out. Where's Vault going? Have you come over here, wait that out. Have you pop over here, wait this out. Now it's time to see what you do. Yoshihiro's army, what are you gonna do? This girder, I'm terrified by what this girder could be like. 
Although you're not moving very fast. That's I can work with that. None of you guys are moving particularly fast here. Experience will make the difference. Sure, sure. Is it going to be a straight line? I kind of hope it's a straight line. Oh, no, they're going to make a, a weird formation there. Um, okay. Let's see what we got here. You're going to only go that far. You're only going to go that far. I'm going to go here. See what happens. Why not? The fight bell has been rung. Ooh, I like that. Okay. Um, ooh, do I send Jigglypuff? No, Jigglypuff's a fighter anyway. Um, all right. You rush up. We're charging. Uh, you will only get there. You'll get there as well. Who's? I would rather have you fighting. How far out? It's not that far. Okay. Wait that. You can pop up one. And you'll go here. I'm going to be honest. The strategy here, beat everybody up as soon as possible. Um, which, speaking of, do I want to charge in now? We could, we could have the bottleneck there. Which isn't a terrible idea. I kind of want to try that. We'll go here, fight, get first crack at you. Because this stops it. You guys can't get through. You're going to have to walk around. So, Ooh, it is a critical hit. I love that. All right, what are you going to do now, buddy? We had an EB on us, so. Oh, I think you're going for the fight bell. Let's take a gamble. What gamble are we talking? An attack boost gamble. I don't like this. I do not like this. This is not. Wake up slap is going to literally push us aside. Oh my Goodness, that is a lot of damage. Oh boy, I think Eevee's gone. Eevee is gone. Oh no. Oh no. This is not good. This is not good, folks. Danger zone activate. Oh boy. Okay. Well, um, forget recruiting. We're trying to survive here. Our daily training pays off now. That goes for you too, Rolts. No mistakes now. I, I agree. Hello. Excuse me. What just happened here? Um, okay, you are three spots away, so if you go here and fight, that would do the damage. Okay, perfect. Um, we do that, we do that, and then... Okay, I, I have an idea. We go here, fight, do this. Confusion. Just go for the knockout. Big damage. That's what I like to see. And then, we'll have you... You can't get there quick enough, and you can't speed up enough. Okay. Um... We're going to have you rush up here, fight this way, punch them both out. There we go. That's some sizable damage. Um, you can claim this one, I suppose. Why not? Wait that out here. I need you to at least be a threat. All right. Jigglypuff. Boy, you're, you're, you're carrying us here. Punch them out as much as you can. Just, ah, uh, that's not a lot. Um, meanwhile, you come here, fight. Just go for the wing attack. Make some loud noises. Boosting the attack there. All right, now what? Now I shall reveal my hand. Don't reveal your hand, please. Oh, it's a defense boost. I can work with defense boost. This is going to be a little bit of an issue if Natsu does... Okay, that's a lot of damage. What are you going to do? You're going to go for me again. That's great. 59 points. I was not prepared for this at all. Girder, I need you not to do anything. I also need you not to do anything. I need you not to do anything. Okay, wake up, slap on the grass type. I don't think this is... He just fell off. Oh boy, this is not good. Um, okay, uh, you need to sing <laughs> ASAP. Just for your own sake, jeez. Um, I would like you... Uh, we've done enough uh, singing and dancing here. Yeah, we'll wait there. Who's low on the health? You are. Okay, here's what I'll do. I will stand here, fight. You might be able to knock out that back guy. Oh, it's not enough. Okay, well, alright, um... I'm... How... Where, where are you going? You can pop back up. Oh, you love to see that. But then now what? I... You can pop back up, fight. Go this way? Okay, let's not even do that yet. First... Let's have you... You can't go... You can go there. Knock you out, but knocking you out doesn't actually do much. Could you go where... You can go here. Or... Alright, I have an idea. 
can, I think you can go where the timber is right now. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have you go here, claim that one. You won't claim it, actually, because you won't stand there. All right, go for the knockout. Run up on it. Blast the timber to kingdom come. Down you go. You fought accidentally, I cannot compete. That's great, I'd love to hear it. Um, and I need you, perfect. I need to come here, fight. We're going for both of these folks down south. Fine with here, just massive damage. Love to see it. And we got the gold, that's also cool. And then, Oichi, I need you to go here, fight, up, maybe knock out um, the big boss here. Come on, that's two, just two? Oh no, all right, two of probably gone. Uh, super effectiveness, very important in Conquest. You boost your defenses, that's not good either. Um, going for the low kick here. That's not a lot of damage, we can work with that. You claim one of our banners, which is not great. Go claim a banner. A potion, really? 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 That's not nice. Yes, claim it. I'm fine with this. I'm okay with this. It's big damage, yes, but I can claim, I can work with that. All, because they have to claim the banners for five turns, so if they can't do that, then it's fine. Four damage, I can work with that. Okay. Machop, don't... Yeah, yes. We need Jigglypuff up to stay alive, at least for... For my sake, because I I would feel sad. Um, it's part of the Wigglytuff line. You know I got a lot. Um, speaking of loving things, I need you to figure out what you're doing next. If you go... Oh, hello. You are in the danger zone. Let's see. We'll go here fight down south we'll, we'll knock you out at this point we're in uh i think we're out of the the chance of um what is it we ran out of turns for just beat them in three turns thing so now we have to beat them with a super effective move i believe um if i go here and down no it's not gonna work okay then don't do that um you will not be recruitable anyway. You need to get knocked out by the flames. You need to be knocked out by a bird or a psychic type. You need to do the same thing. Okay, so you're just a, a bad guy. All right, so we'll work with this. Uh, I'm gonna go here, fight, just hopefully do the damage, come on. One, two, off you go. Uh, you're gonna have to climb back up, I know that much. Um, you're going to... Let's do this. The fight, go up, push you all. That should... Yep, that knocks you down. You're going to go here, fight. Maybe... This will knock you out. That's great. Flame wheel with the run-up should do massive damage. Any moment now. And boom. Down you go. Perfect. Love to see it. All right, what else we got? Um... What else do we have? We've got an enemy, we got the Machop down here that Rowlet, not Rowlet, Rufflet is um, standing over. We've got the Girder here. Let's see, where are you? One, two, three. Right, it's three spots? One, two, three. Okay, so would it work if I did this? No, because you're on a different level, okay. Um, in that case, I'm gonna have you just claim this flag for now. That should end our turn here. All right, the real battle begins now. Uh, it sure does. You're near the bell. I don't like that. Oh dear, we seem to be struggling. Yes, you are. And the Machop's gonna have to do the same thing. Hop around. Do a little bit of healing. Okay, that's good. I like to see that. In fact, how do I want to approach this? I don't want to pop it down because you'll probably pop back up. So, all right, who needs healing? Um, everybody but the rock. Okay, so I'm gonna have you... Go. All right, I'll have you go here and wait that out. I, I know we're claiming the banners, but honestly, they're just for the health purposes. We'll have you wait there. We have claimed all the banners. We gotta keep them for five turns though. So, and if we don't get the gifts, we don't get the gifts. What are you gonna do? Um, I'm gonna wait that out. I'm gonna have you. You can jump all the way over here. Jeez. Uh, go here. Fight. Hit the bell. Why not? Well, oh, that's not good. We broke the bell. Um, all right, so we ran out of attack boosts. I'm going to have you sit there, wait as well. Okay, it's your move. Looks like I'm at a disadvantage. You are. 
but it wouldn't be any fun if the odds were in my favor, not knowing whether you're going to win or lose, that's the, the true thrill of the battlefield. I agree. Please get away from here. Uh, I'm going to chop around that way, and you are going to do what? You're going to run that way as well. Okay. All right, number of turns left. We have to protect the banners for five turns. Everyone can get a little bit of a boost of health, which I uh, love to see. All right, here's the game plan now. We need you two to get knocked out by somebody that matters. So, first things first, Bird, I need you to go... You gotta get next to it, right? So, I'm gonna go here. Why not? Let's just grab this, see what's up. Get the potion, that's nice. Um, I'm gonna have you not do anything. I'm gonna have you run back, actually. We'll wait this out. If I... Okay, where are you? Uh, you're here. One, two, three. Are you able to stay here, fight, and hit? Yes, okay, perfect. Love to see it. Go for the confusion here. Knocks you out. That's a super effective move, knockout. Love to see that. Little gift package there as well. Um, I'm actually going to have you run back here. I know I'm giving up a banner seemingly, but it's on purpose. Uh, I also do not want you in the fight at all. Alright, go for it. Do your game plans. Grab a banner. Please grab a banner. If you grab a banner, I can uh, go collect some gifts. We'll do a little bit more healers. Um, okay, who should actually go grabbing gifts? You probably should. So I'm going to have you go down here, wait it out. You can follow, actually. Wait that out. You go here for the fight. Confusion here. I'm being a little greedy. This is probably not the ideal thing to do. But I, I do want to get as many of these gifts as I can. So uh, we go here, fight. This should knock you out with a super effective move with a wing attack. Okie doke. You're quite something. Taking me down takes some doing, you know. Okay, all we've got left is big boss. You're going to jump up one. You're going to steal the gift, aren't you? Yep. Uh, this is also going to do some sizable damage because you're not just flying yet. 140 gold, I can work with up gold. Um, three, cool. I'm going to have you, this is very um, not smart here. I'm going to purposely let you take some of these things. So I'm going to stand here, wait that out. You're going to go this way. You're going to grab that, grab the gold. You're going to go here, grab that. Iron wristband. I do not know what that is. Uh, raises defense, occasionally breaks during use. I'm going to keep the potion, but that seems very cool. Grab a banner. Do not hit me. Grab a banner. Perfect. Love to see it. Um, we have 21 turns to work with this. All right, so let's see. We've got that gift, and I think that's it, right? Let's see. Go around. Yep. It's just that gift. Okay. Can you reach it? You cannot. Can you reach it? You also cannot. Okay, I'm going to have you rush around here. Wait that out. You're coming back here. I'm going to have you um, go here, I suppose. Wait that out. You stay. Oh, I probably shouldn't have locked it. Probably should have had them switch so that they could um, switch places and heal up a little bit. Grab one of the banners. Do not go for us. Grab one of the banners. Or stay there. That also works. Um, all right. My greedy plan has been fulfilled. I barely did anything, and ultimately, I'm not even sure if it was worth it. But we're gonna we're we're going for the we're going for it all. Confusion. There's some big damage here. 16 points. And that bounces you off. All right, love to see it. Um, you're gonna go here because we're gonna have to. Oh, we can't let you go. Uh, we gotta stand next to it, so it's fine. Um, I'm gonna have you pop up here. I want you to come around and fight me. Pop that there. It's the end of our turn. All right. Um, there's really no point in. We can either wait for him to come to us, or we can just sit here. Do that. Take that out. You walk up over here in case you knock ruffle it out. I'm gonna have you over 
No, I want you there. Right? Yes, I want you there. So wait that out. And you can... I don't know, take the long way around. Your, your Darumaka's kind of just vibing. Alright, you're rushing around. Five turns to protect the banners. You get a little bit of a healer there. Um, what is your zone? Um, you can get up to there. I feel like you could potentially go farther, so... I'm gonna have you... I don't know, rush around here? Anyone else want to do anything? Uh, Ruffla might be taking an L for us here. Um, unfortunately, I can't just switch these two positions, because you would have to move out, and then you would move in, then the second turn that would flip. Uh, so I think what I'm gonna do is end my turn. No one needs to move. You're moved. You're gonna rush at us. Probably hit Rufflet. As long as you don't knock us out, we're good. Alright, that's fine by me. Barely living, but we're living all the same. All we have to do is protect the banners for four turns, um, or knock you out, which we're about to. Um, let's do this. You go here, fight. You're gonna go for the girder. Confusion here. And the critical hit knockout to wrap it up here. They're good. We must retreat. We did it! Victory is ours! Yeah, because I'm busy trying to figure out, like, Eevee, are you still with us? Good boy, good boy. Victory! Because uh, we can just sit here, grab the the banners and all that sort of stuff. Um, do we get bonuses? We do! Okay, so even though we're knocked out, we still get a little bit of a healer. Uh, let's see how much of a link we get as I stretch my bones! Um, I also just realized that Oichi and uh, Jigglypuff are commanders, which I learned is what the gold thing means. That means that a commander has to beat a commander in order to recruit them. Um... Which, thank you for the comment section. Uh, this game, I don't know if I've specified it in the past. I have played Conquest before, so this game, if you want to spoil things or give advice, feel free to do so. Love to love to see it, the more the merrier, because I don't know as much as I need to know. Lots of strength boosts there. Bunch of move strengthenings there. Some gold, that potion, the iron wristband, and everything of the sort. We can recruit everybody! Yes! Love to see it. Um, we can't get the main person, obviously, but uh, it's very good that we can get the rest. All right, what's the result? Phew. Oh boy, you are a worthy winner. But this is all part of the rich tapestry of battle. Victory tastes all the sweeter once you have known the bitterness of defeat. Anyway, congratulations. You won a battle that will be talked about for years to come throughout the various social media sites. Like, I don't know, WarTube. If that's the, if that makes sense? YouTube, but uh, for Conquest. Conquest Tube, there you go. We've claimed victory. Victory for us. So let's the warriors who we should recruit. Um, how about all of them? Thank you very much. Uh, actually, wait up. 70% with Timber, 42% with Pansage. I get the feeling you probably want a fighting type. Um, 70 with Machop, 70 with Timber. Alright, that's solid stuff. Um, yes, I would like to recruit you because I would like to recruit you. Very much to oblige. I shall be happy to join your cause. Okay, everybody gets dumped in, uh, everyone's getting dumped as far as I can tell. Probably, oh, we'll just to toss them on really for that. Um, yeah, just jump everybody in Greenleaf. Yep, yep, yep. Yoshihiro's army has been defeated and has been forced to retreat. And by retreat, I mean join us. All right. Congratulations, Lord Adorn. Yeah, we've finally beaten all the bosses. Yay, that's it. Game over, everyone. Ha ha ha. You now have seven kingdoms under your control. Are you always this pleased with yourself? Uh, uh, excuse me. I don't, I don't know how many kingdoms you have, but it's highly unlikely you have seven or greater. Surely you are aware of the crisis facing Runsai as we speak. Oh yeah, little, little the, the the thing up north. We we had the the cutscene a while ago. We might have another one right now. Meanwhile, Nubunaga. Uh, someone has shown me how to pronounce that, and I do not remember. Nubunaga, Nubunaga, perhaps. Nubunaga, who had been gathering his forces in the north of Runsai, had conquered eight kingdoms himself. He's one up in us. Of course he is. Just two kingdoms remain. Uh, Terria, ter Terrera, Terrera, under Shingen's command, in Illusio, Kenshin's kingdom. And those are the two folks for those kingdoms. Both were renowned throughout Ransai as warlords of great strength. Indeed, even Nob Nobunaga himself was said to fear them. I'm not scared at all. I don't know what I'm expecting, but I'm not scared. Yeah, sure, why not? So, what if Nobunaga captured those two kingdoms? That, that, that would be terrible! Nobody would be able to stop him then! 
So do I have to say what we're all thinking? Uh, I guess I do. Doran, you've got to get Shingen and Kenshin on our on your side. There are no other options. Are you on our side? That's a fair question to ask. The battle is won. Save progress. Absolutely. This is a long episode right now. It's uh, 43 minutes, although I'm not sure. That's definitely getting cut down. Um, but by how much is the question? We save it there. Um, all worries have not been delegated to tasks. Let's proceed to the next month. We might as well do that now. Everyone do a little bit of training yourselves. You can see the little boost, actually, which is fun. Uh, June, year two. Okay. June, year two. You're now able to challenge the Warlords of Terrera and Iluzo to, Iluzo? Iluzio, to battle. Um, you can be reached, uh, Terrera, by... Oops, I should probably... Uh, so you can be reached by... Uh, Chrysela, which currently has zero people in it, and, um, and uh, Pugilus Bugilus, which has a bunch of folks in it. And Illusio is through Terrera or Chrysalia. Okay, Chrysalia. Chrysalia, I think that's probably technically not it. Um, uh, Illusio, Illusio? Illusio is clearly a psychic type place. Um, and they have a Gallade at 300. Jeez, look at, like, our, our best guy is 227. And then Terrera. 321! Oh man, that's a lot of that's a lot of that's a lot of power right there. Um, and it's a ground type area, it looks like, although they've got a couple of fire types. I suppose to beat the grass types that could theoretically come in. Cool. Um, so next time, I'm gonna tell you right now, uh, I do not feel confident in beating either of these folks with our best army, as you can see here, just by power level, let alone super effective. So, in the next episode, we're probably gonna do a little recruiting here, we're gonna do recruiting there, see if there's any other locations of recruitable ability, which it doesn't look like it, but at least those two areas. Uh, we'll do some more recruiting, maybe move things around, potentially challenge someone. I actually don't know yet. Also, this city is floating. It's literally floating. I don't know if you can tell. Um, you can see it on the, on the screen, on the, uh, on the big screen here. Um, it's floating right there. I, okay, wild. Um, anyway, next time we're going to do some training and hope that they don't invade this currently empty town. So until then, everyone, thank you very much for listening, watching, and supporting in any way, shame, or for any way, shame? Any way, any way, shape, or form that you do. That's it. Until next time, take care.